I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. The vision of Dural Academy Charter Middle High School is to set the standard for outstanding student achievement while providing a safe and nurturing academic environment. Good morning, Good morning Firebirds. Firebirds. I'm Ariana Ricardez. And I'm Laura Febles. Today is December 13th, 2021. And, and you're, you're watching Firebird TV. Now let's test your trivia knowledge on what went on today in history. This year's 2021 Miss Universe was finally crowned to Harnas Santhu this weekend. The annual contest was held in Israel and marked the 70th anniversary. The pageant was filled with over 80 contestants with the struggles of the pandemic and some politics. A man was rushed to a hospital in critical condition Monday morning following a shooting in Northwest Miami-Dade. According to Miami-Dade, police officers received a shot spotter alert in the area of Northwest 66th Street and 20th Avenue. Police say victim was found shot right in the abdomen. Now here's Natalie Feliz with this week's Minute Media. Good morning Firebirds and welcome to this week's Minute Media. Grammy winning rapper Megan Thee Stallion earned her Bachelor of Science degree in Health Administration, a goal she said to honor both her late mother and her late grandmother. Over the past weekend, Max Verstappen was confirmed as the Formula One world champion after beating Lewis Hamilton in a controversial race at the Abu Dhabi Grand Prix. This Friday, October 17th, Spider-Man No Way Home will be released. Fans have been waiting for a very long time and there are many theories as to what will happen in the movie and who will make a guest appearance. Signing off for Firebird TV, I'm Natalie Feliz. Now here's Annabella Abdullah with some information on the Builders Club. Builders Club is a club that gives back to the community. They do beach cleanups, park cleanups, food drives, and more. My name is Mrs. Gonzalez, and I am the club sponsor of Builders Club. Ms. Gonzalez is a 7th grade language arts teacher at Doral Academy. She has been running Builders Club for about two years now. But we are just purely service-based, giving back through the community, through money donations, through collecting drive items, and then actually going out and doing service-based projects within the community. Okay, this is our meeting date. Again, meeting date We get the events a couple ways. Sometimes it's us reaching out to organizations and emailing them and you know just presenting ourselves and saying, hey, we are a middle school based service club. If you have any events or things that you need volunteers or hands on deck to help with, uh, we have plenty of people willing to serve. A lot of times people think that an impact has to be like significant or huge, but actually if it's just every person that makes up society and makes up a community does a little, little piece, then those little pieces add up and that's what makes the big impact. Signing off, I'm Annabella Abdullah, reporting. Here are the daily sports reports to keep you updated on all your latest athletic news.
Last Friday, the boys' varsity soccer team claimed victory against Slam in their home game with a score of 3-0. The girls' varsity basketball team played against Westminster on Friday in the draw gym. The game ended with draw winning 44-39. Today, they take on Carrollton at 5 p.m. at Carrollton. Good luck, Firebirds! This weekend, eight of our Firebirds placed in their tournament at Capital City Classic against schools all across South Florida. Congrats to everyone who placed. This weekend, the girls' varsity soccer team had a showcase tournament in Orlando. The team won against Bishop Moore 4-0 on Friday, and on Saturday, they unfortunately lost 5-0 against Bartram Trail. That's all for today's sports report. Signing off, I'm Gabby Sotomayor reporting. And now it's time for your morning announcements. Yeah, but... Okay, there will be middle school science tutoring today at 208 from 3.40 to 4.40 p.m. Track and field trials for both middle and high school will be today in the football fields at 3.45 p.m. Today at 6.30 is a band holiday show in the auditorium. Doors open at 6 p.m. and there's a $10 entry fee. Tickets are sold online. Tomorrow is the Green Club photo competition. The link to enter is on the Dural Green Club Instagram. Submissions are now open until tomorrow. Tomorrow there will be biology tutoring in 209C from 2.30 to 4.30 p.m. There will be a Bible club meeting tomorrow from 2.40 to 3.20 p.m. in 522H. Tomorrow is the orchestra holiday show at 6.30 p.m. Doors open at 6 and there is a $10 entry fee that can be paid online. On Wednesday, December 15th, there will be an essay incubator in 506H at 2.30 p.m. There will be a chess club meeting on Wednesday, December 15th from 3.30 to 4.30 in 606H. Before we wrap up today's show, let's have a moment of silence and reflection. That's all for today, Firebirds, and remember to follow us on all our social medias. Thanks for watching Firebird, Firebird TV. TV.